With your CIG TV News Update, I'm Jay Earhart, in for Donna Bush. In today's top stories, the National Children's Festival of the Arts has paid tribute to its best performers. Fifteen primary and high school students collected individual gold awards in poverty and narrative. This was followed by a presentation of gold and silver and bronze awards in music, which were awarded to school levels. Schools were also recognized for each of the categories in which they participated, including speech, drama, and dance. The annual National Children's Festival of the Arts is a showcase of the Cayman Islands' brightest talents in the literary, visual, and performing arts. Each year, it features students from government and private schools throughout the Cayman Islands. CIG-TV will begin airing its coverage of the NCFA concerts starting on Tuesday, July 1st at 8 o'clock. Yesterday, John Gray High School celebrated the end of the school year with a cultural evening, which featured some of the top performers from the NCFA. The evening's program included choral, instrumental, and spoken word performances from around two dozen young people. These included members of the school band and the school choir. The event was co-hosted by the school and its Parents Teachers Association. Guests also received copies of the principal's report on the 2013-14 school year. Well, we end tonight with a quick visit to the Family Fun Fitness Session at the Cayman Islands Baptist Church in Savannah, which also took place last night. A joint effort by the YMCA and the Family Resource Center, the evening included fun, easy circuit training for all fitness levels. Participants also took part in a healthy family workshop. A similar session was also planned for the East End Civic Center at the same time. The YMCA and the FRC had organized an island-wide launch for the sessions during the child month in May, and plans are to keep these continuing for a monthly or bi-monthly basis in all five districts on Grand Cayman. Well, as always, if you missed today's news update, you can get all of the details on our Facebook and YouTube pages. And of course, don't forget to tune in to Radio Cayman's Talk Today show, which is always packed with exciting guests. I'm Jay Earhart. Thanks for watching.